All right, bye. How's your cotton? Pardon? I love, I love growing up on the farm. Like, just so so much space. Just do whatever you want. And do you lend yeah. a hand with the actual farming? Like, are you like getting literally getting stuck into the cow, bringing the calves out? <laughs> I've never done. I've watched that being done, but I will just leave out to my dad. You know, he's the he's the expert in that. So mm -hmm. I just take a back seat in that one. So what was your team locally growing up here? Did you play for a like junior team? In Right, man. How's it going? All right. Are you still up, still up the road, are you? Right. One sec. See my mate, he's just up the road. Do you want to go, do you want to go say hello? Yeah, if you, if you want, yeah. Paddy, what's your favourite Instagram filter? Don't need a filter. Do you, are you saying you go no filter? No filter. Just the normal. That's a big claim. I thought you'd be maybe a bit of a slumber man or... <laughs> nah, the, there's one. Uh, Valencia, Oh, I yes, I do have one. <laughs> no filter, but no, seriously, I do have one I always use. There he is. <laughs> well, that's your mate, is it? <laughs> nah, don't be sorry. This is my best mate. Stephen. Oh. Okay, Stephen? Stephen, yeah. I um, you know, was checking your Instagram before we did this and I just like the fact that you know you're just willing to just get the shirt off. Oh uh, no bother. No problem. Sort of just get it set up. Yeah. Do you have would you have like hire someone to come and ho on holiday with you and just get the right shots or whatever, or are you just getting a mate to do that or whatever? No, that's why I bring my mates, you know. That's ah, the, right, that's yeah, the main yeah. reason why they come, you know. Yeah, yeah. You don't want to hear what he's saying about you, mate. Well, you're talk you're talking to the car, are you, Paddy? Yeah, he's talking to me too. Never shuts up. Have you ever had like teammates or mates over here to the farm? Yeah, I've had a few. Uh, Chris Mullen came over two months ago. He got a tour. He got a tour of the farm. He loved it, so he might actually start up his own farm now after, after being here. Was, well, I was going to say, is that his big summer goals? Being like, you know, people going to Dubai, Ibiza, or whatever, and Chris Mullen's like, you booked me a plane to Ballyclare immediately because this is where everyone's going. Yeah. Oh, Paddy, I'd love to stick about me, but I think we have to get back to Belfast, don't we? We have that thing, we're late for the... No, it's not, it's not the five o'clock. Oh, brilliant. We'll stick about. <laughs> <laughs> good one, Stephen. Is, it, is there like good local support here? Would people sort of come up and chat to you when you're in the town? Oh, I, I think that's the... The thing is, not just Ballyclare, it's Northern Ireland in a whole. Like, mm -hmm. Anywhere we go, Belfast, and there's always people coming up to me talking, to, talking about football and telling you to put your shirt on. <laughs> Paddy, thanks a million for having us. Before we go, final question. What is the best thing about living on a farm? Why don't you ask Stephen? Because he's, he's a cow, Paddy. Shush, don't interrupt Stephen, all right? Stephen, what are we saying there, mate? You don't mind dropping us down the road here, do you? I no problem. Cheers. Fancy going for a pint? Oh, I sounds good. Cheers. What do you like? Full fat, semi skim. Got to work, bro. <laughs> <laughs>